Hey guys, we're back again today with another science experiment with the kids. Asher, tell them what we're doing today. Elephant toothpaste. Elephant toothpaste, that's right. Now, we have multiple settings of elephant toothpaste today. We are gonna go for small, a little bit bigger, and then I think we're gonna try to finish it off with a giant. <laughs> Stay tuned. <laughs> There's three bottles that I'm gonna do, and one bottle is for him, which is this one. And this is gonna be the last one. This is our five gallon bottle. Dad, can I uh -huh. your gloves? No, you can get your own gloves. Oh. Okay. Let's do ingredients. Yeah? Yeah. Bring me some stuff. So for this experiment, you're going to need hydrogen peroxide. Now this is a giant bottle of 12% hydrogen peroxide. Uh, this is gonna be for a more uh, concentrated solution, a bigger reaction. Uh, the stuff you can get at the store is 3%. That'll kind of do a weak reaction. You could also get 6% at the store. Uh, I had to use, I had to go to Amazon to get this. Now, if you want to use something like 35, 30% and do the devil's toothpaste, um, we are not going to do that here today. 30 to 35% means you need to be a chemistry teacher or have some kind of special license to get those. And we're just, you know, a dad, a mom, and two kids. And we also need soap. Dish also soap. need some dish soap. You're also gonna need potassium iodide. Now, potassium iodide, you could also use yeast. Uh, this is gonna give a better reaction. Uh, when you mix this in with the hydrogen peroxide, it is going to react similar to the uh, baking soda and vinegar that we did. It's gonna react and all the oxygen is gonna be released. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add in soap. The soap is going to concentrate um, all of the oxygen from expanding and it's gonna create that bubble effect that we're using. Now, you can make gross orange type um, of colors. Uh, if you wanna change it up, we also do have some food coloring. You can get this in any kind of baking shop. I think we're good. Yep. So we do need this tiny, tiny cup. <laughs> you can barely see it when I'm far away. We're gonna start with the tiny cup just so we can see what the reaction's gonna be, okay? So we're gonna start off. We've got our hydrogen peroxide. Mm -hmm. We're gonna pour in, it's supposed to be about 50 milliliters, which is about a quarter of a cup. We're probably gonna do a little bit more than that. I think that's about half. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Are you putting up in some soap with me? Okay, stop, stop, stop. That's probably too much. I got it. Okay, take it back to mommy. <laughs> I should pick out some food coloring. We're gonna do some blue. Do some blue? Yeah. Do some. Okay. Put that back in. I should try to have purple. Hold on. All right, and the last step. And put in the potassium iodide. You ready? Yeah. Safety goggles on. All right. Now One, two, three. Oh, that was lame. That was lame. We moved on to a bigger bottle. Yep. All right. What about bigger? Yep. We're gonna try a little bit bigger. And this time we're gonna put in some more potassium iodide. So let's do. Go ahead and put that in a little bit more there. Put some soap in. Over. Okay. Yeah, the next one I'm just gonna dump in a whole bunch of it. See what happens. Is this enough, Queen? I think that's enough. Let's go ahead and mix that up. What? Let's see if this will work. <laughs> All right, back up, Amelia. This way. All right. It's working. A little better. Whoa! Ah! It fell down. No. Yeah. Works a little bit better. Yeah. But now it's more one to Still down. needs more mm -hmm. of this stuff. It's moving. Whoa, it is getting cooler though. Yeah. Ah, it's coming! It's coming! Well, this is a little bit better. Yeah. Look at it! Just look at it! Look at that! Um, so we're doing this one and I can't wait for that down. big one over there. One, two, three.
All right, final experiment. Go big, go home. So we're gonna use our five gallon jug. Um, camera around here and here. So this works. This works, anyone who wants to duplicate it, it is, let's say half a gallon of 12% hydrogen Whoa. peroxide. Don't touch it. Uh, it's gonna be about 50 grams of potassium iodide tablets. And mix it in a five gallon jug, see what happens. Let's go see. Three, two, one. Okay. What science is Well, I think it's super concentrated too. Probably. It's going down. Yeah. It's going down. You, you're it's going down. Oh, it's going up. It's going down. <laughs> what happens if it leaks the top and it goes like flying? It's like coiling itself around the entire tub. Yeah, this is how you make Whoa, it. Whoa, what did you do? You made it more of like a volcano than the, the tube that was coming out. Whoa, check out that heat. Yeah. Okay, careful you your shoes. Six. Whoa. I did like this thing. Clothes getting hot. Hot. Look like the top of an ice cream cone. Well, it wasn't the geyser that we had planned on, but it was still pretty cool, right? This is where I need to step in. Just because we got a result doesn't mean it's the one we wanted. I built this to make a projectile, and we didn't do it. And I was not going to just walk away without making that happen. So, Round two, because the first time that it happened, it was bad. So what we did is we went ahead and we got some 35% uh, hydrogen peroxide. The last thing we used was 12, so I'm hoping this is a little bit more concentrated. Uh, I will put a link in the description of where I got this. It was Walmart, really not hard, but I, I'll make sure you guys have an easy, easy access to that. Um, we're gonna do about two bottles of it, so that's 32 ounces, which would be about four cups. Now, to be honest, I did take about one cup to do a little bit of a test, so for this, this try, we'll do three cups. And then we also got the potassium iodide again, same one that we did last time, but this time I'm gonna do the entire bottle, right? I don't know what else I would save this for, so I'm trying to make the biggest explosion I can. Let's use all of it. And 100, for the test, maybe I used five or 10, so call it 90 to 95. Let's see what happens. Three, two, one. I'm gonna set it better myself. If you like this video, leave a like. If you wanna see some more videos like this, hit the subscribe button and also click that bell, that way you get notified when we do more. It's been fun, and we hope to see you guys next time.